Hello, I'm Angie Kelly with Crawl Like Realtors. Thanks for tuning in to the Angie Kelly Real Estate Show. Did you know? Hey, everybody. Hi, I'm Angie Kelly with Crawl Like Realtors. I'm excited about this new listing. What do you want to know? Today, I'm accompanied by Chris Murphy, president of MN Murphy Pest Control. Chris, thank you for being here today. Thank you for inviting me, Angie. Today we're going to talk about mosquitoes. Chris, I know you offer a mosquito service. Can you tell everyone watching sure. today a little bit about uh, what you do with servicing a property with mosquitoes? Absolutely. With the mosquito program that we run, it'll generally start up as the temperatures pick up and we start to get those mosquitoes. You do want to be proactive on that. It's much like a lot of things, it's much harder if the population is already built up to, to correct that than it is to keep the population from building up. But it runs about every 20 to 30 days. We run on a cycle where we come by. Uh, the, really the goal is to, to take care of your outdoor living area. As you know, a lot more people these days have an outdoor living space that they like to use during the spring and summer. And we want to protect that and try to help uh, make it more enjoyable. So that's what we're going to focus on. Uh, mosquitoes like to live under the leaves and foliage of um, plants and different things. So that's one of our focuses. We have a mist, um, a mist product that we put under that and we'll treat those areas uh, so that that'll help reduce and eliminate the populations. Uh, you, you can't realistically say you're not going to have any mosquitoes. That's just, uh, that's not a realistic expectation. But we can make the living area much more enjoyable. Um, like if you've got a pool or a deck or any of those type things, we can treat those areas and make it where you can enjoy that with your family on the evenings and that sort of thing a lot better than you can without it. Okay, so as far as I think the general public thinks that you have to have standing water in your yard, uh, those would be the people who would need mosquito control or mosquito service. But you're saying not just people with standing water, but also um, people should treat their bushes around their pool, their deck, and so right. forth. So it's not just standing water that needs it. It's also uh, foliage and things like that. Right. Yeah, it, absolutely standing water is a problem, but you also want to take note if you have a lot of landscape, if you have a lot of heavy landscape, bushes and shrubs and that sort of thing, uh, the mosquitoes will actually live on the bottoms of those, so on the bottoms of the leaves. So that'll, that'll kind of help promote mosquitoes as well. You certainly want to, if you have uh, stored items that are holding water, bucket lids or buckets in general, uh, some people you know, have a, a storage shed and they tend to throw things out behind it. Um, we see that a lot. Or uh, for sure, if you have like tires or something stored that you swap out for winter or something like that, if you store them behind a building on the property, that's gonna create a problem. Swimming pools that have not been serviced properly and they're, they have water in them or on the covers, those will have a mosquito problem. But it's not just limited to that. Bird baths even, a lot of people don't think about the oh. bird baths. Uh, bird baths, if they're not being dumped and refilled regularly can be a problem. Or even the small trays under plants. Everybody waters plants, but they don't necessarily take into account what those trays will breed and harborage. Not oh. just mosquitoes, but other insects as well. So, That's great news. Yeah. Wow. You got you to gotta pay attention to all those things and certainly the foliage. Most people that we do business with don't necessarily have a lot of these things going on, but they just want to make sure that the uh, pool area or the back patio area where they're going to barbecue or whatever is going to be as, as tolerable as possible in the summertime and usable as possible. If you spend all that money on it, you don't want to have to run inside at dark just or dusk because the mosquitoes are going to take you away. We want to help control that for you so you can enjoy it. That's great information. So Chris, last question. Someone who signs up for your mosquito service, how often does your company come out and treat for mosquitoes? Angie, that's a good question. Our program, we do need to have access uh, pretty much any time because we do have to fight the weather a little bit in the Memphis area. You're going to have some rain days and things like that. So we do need access all the way around the property. Um, and we can call ahead to do that. But that program runs about every 20 to 30 days. Um, some of that, just like I say, we're weather dependent, uh, but optimally we're going to be in the 20 to 25 day window. In some cases, if we get a lot of rain, we'll have to extend that out a little bit. But 
Uh, generally, it's 20 to 25 days. So, Chris, if anyone is watching, what is wanting termites, ants, pests, whatever it is, how would they go about contacting you, and do you offer free consultations? Thanks, Angie. Yes, we do. Um, you can call our office at 388-0852. That's 388-0852. Or you can look us up on the web at inman-murphy.com. Uh, and we have some form field pages on there that you can fill out as well. So either one of those, if you give us a call, there's no charge to come out and check out the property, see what you need. Uh, in general, pests we can set up right over the phone. It's quick and easy. So. Wonderful. Thanks, everybody, for tuning in. Have a great day.